One of the first questions many parents have are, who are all of these people who are helping to take care of my baby? And truly, it takes a village to take care of a baby who is so small and so sick. The main person that you may meet in the NICU is a neonatologist. This is a physician who's had additional training, specialization, uh, and is board certified in the care of sick newborns. In addition, there's usually what we call other medical staff. They may include fellows, and fellows are physicians who are getting specialty training so that they can become a neonatologist, and the resident house staff in a teaching facility. Most units also use the neonatal nurse practitioner. This is a nurse who, like myself, has had extensive background in the care of these babies and who goes on to further education and board certification in the care of newborns. The neonatal nursing staff are the people who are there 24 hours a day at the bedside of your baby, watching for every change, giving every therapy, helping us as we manage the care of your newborn. Respiratory therapists are the individuals who are so very helpful in managing the respiratory needs of your baby. They help us with things such as the drawing of blood gases, helping with x-rays, setting up equipment that the baby will use to help breathe. The NICU has a registered dietitian who rounds with us daily, who helps us understand how to best meet the very, very unique nutritional needs of a very small baby. We have perinatal and neonatal parent support staff who spend a lot of time trying to help mom and dad get through the situation as well as the baby does. Frequently, they may be neonatal social workers uh, who will help you with additional needs around discharge, what you need to do to get your baby ready to go home, follow-up services. And then finally, there's a, just a, a large group of ancillary personnel who work in the NICU who sometimes are behind the scenes, but they help all of us do our job best so that your baby has the best possible outcome.